Farmers sure don't have a lot of off time. But man, oh man, do they know how to have fun. Let's get to it. So I've been over here envying Zach and his race car and his boy over here starting out racing and uh, I envy both of them. I don't have a hobby. All the corn's planted and we got a little free time on our hands. Boy oh boy, that kid just never stops doing cookies. He just loves that thing. Uh, Zach, I think you're going to have to get a road grader just to keep up with him. Man. He likes moving some gravel, that's for sure. Takes right after his daddy. Sure, that is definitely his boy. But Zach has all these toys. He has his race car. He has uh, his boy has that. He has that boat over there. He has a camper. I don't have any toys. I got a little money, if you know from the past. I sold a farm, so I got some money now. I need to get my own hobby something to do on the farm you know we're out here there's you know I guess Jim just showed up huh all right not as impressive as Zach's boy uh, yeah I would just look away from that I guess but I have a little idea I think I have something I might enjoy having on the farm and if not I probably can at least find a use for it, at least around here in Minnesota. I mean, we do got some uh, high moisture ground. It gets a little soggy at times around here. We're just finishing up pressure washing this planter. Jim. Hey, Jim. Are you going to move your car out of the way? I need to fold this up. No? I guess I got to fit in this thing? Oh man, this thing almost looks like you can uh, have some straps on it. If you can't find parking, just get some straps and wear it as a book bag or something. Man, this thing is... How do I... Where do I put my legs? My arms? I feel shrunken. Alright. This thing is... Uh surprisingly loud hmm I don't want no one to see this so I'm gonna park it back here we'll just uh yeah we'll, we'll leave it right here we won't tell Jim hold the planter up it's done for the year it's a good feeling right here finally done all the hard nights all the long days and long nights, all the sleep deprivation comes to the end until harvest time, hopefully at least. All right, I'm gonna get this parked in the shed and then I need to head to town. All right, so you're probably wondering, oh, is he gonna go into racing with Zach? No, I don't think I'm gonna get a sponsor like Zach did at least. I highly doubt it. So, I have different plans. I don't want to just copy Zach because uh, that's unoriginal. But uh, it would be pretty cool to be a race car driver. I actually worked when I was growing up for a farmer. He had a uh, high speed uh, dragster. He let me uh, drive it once. Man, was that, uh, I think they call it the needle. The needle dragster, man, was that a fun rocket? It was fun. I, I have, I know a lot of farmers. A lot of farmers, they work hard and they play hard too. And that is what I want to be, because life, you need to, uh, you don't need to work for a living. You need to work to live, enjoy your life. You know, get a boat. Get a camper. Go enjoy yourself. Don't, don't work for life unless you really enjoy working that much. But I don't think I can uh, ever enjoy, even if I'm a full-time farmer, work all the time. Gotta have a hobby. Gotta do something. 
Yeah. Maybe I can paint tractors. Red, white, and blue. It's always good to see some patriotism around here. So, this is a plan. I don't know if it's the best idea, but I, I have had my eye on a monster truck for a while. Now, do you understand why it would be good to utilize this in Minnesota? With all these wet roads, wet fields, if I gotta go check cattle, I got the perfect mud in my wheel. Now, you might think it's kind of dumb, but you know what? This is a hobby. You know, there's a lot of people. Everybody spends their money on, they waste their money, what some people think wasting their money, on something they enjoy. I think I'm going to purchase me a monster truck. So first we got this, uh, looks about like a 2004, I'm not for sure of the exact year model. So I was, it should say GMC, all the way from New York, huh? It is a Chevy, so I guess the license plate shouldn't say GMC, that would be kind of an oxymoron. Uh, got some pretty tough tires on it Reese's hitch I'm gonna have to get more of an upgrade on that because I plan on pulling a lot this thing looks like there's uh, somebody left their uh, chew can over here the cab looks a little messed up must have messed up the cab when they did the lift it sounds good but you can tell that's not a lot of horses and that, that sound. Not really looking for a flatbed. This would be a, like a, this would be the ultimate tow truck. If you had a tow business in Minnesota, you could tow anybody, anywhere. This reminds me of the Diesel Brothers. It's an old Ford with a souped up power stroke, I believe definitely can sound it has a few horsepower behind this board now this is more in line what I'm thinking Ooh, they have some straps is that so the axle doesn't fall off you, okay okay I really don't know if that's strap uh, it's got a very unique paint style on it hmm hmm there's a fuel tank, so we are definitely safe. This is one of them, uh, is it a standing monster truck? Oh, it has a seat. Some of these monster trucks have you stand. And I think you're probably going to be exposed to the elements in this thing. I could use a little bit of height, but uh, I guess people think I'm a toddler driving down the road. Oh yeah, you can feel the power in this thing, and hear it. Ooh, yeah. Yeah, you, you can feel the road. This is almost like riding on a bike. Wow. That thing is impressive. <laughs> I don't think this is going to fit on our trailer. We're going to have to take off the tires. But... We're going down a country road. You don't really have to worry about DOT too much. Look, do a little handstand here. There we go. I'm definitely impressed with this thing. Wondering if I can uh, jump this building right here. Oh, we got it, we got it. Oh man, keep going, keep. Oh, here we go. There we go. We did her. Now, in real life, this probably wouldn't be possible because uh, this would be more like demolition than climbing. Man, see how much fun you could have in one of these? The only problem is, I bet this thing, uh, you gotta have a lot of money for gas because uh, it guggles it. 
Alright, sounds just like about every other Ford. I was expecting more of a meaty sound. Now this thing would be impressive to have. The turn is not great on it. And uh, beans, you would think these would have great traction, but on hard pack roads they get kind of slushy. You can see we're sliding a little bit rear end yeah we're going around got a lot of body roll because you need a heck of a suspension on these things let's see how Zach's boy where oh 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 yeah here we go uh, not as good as Zach's boy let's get these things home I have I don't think Definitely going to have to pull out the extensions and everything for this load. Alright, I just don't think we're wide enough. I don't know. We're going to have to basically monster truck it up on that ramp. Ugh, it's going to be rough. Alright, we're up. We're up. We're, we're up. I can't see anything. Oh, now I can. Alright, I think... I think we are good. Oh, wow. Uh, we'll try it here. I know, I should probably take these side tires off for the transportation. But trust me, we're not going that far. I mean, oh, what, we go two blocks and then we're on country roads? What they don't know won't hurt them. Something looks like it. This is just bound to break here. All right, let's get out of here. Let's skedaddle. Uh, it's still on there. I'm surprised the Ford hasn't found its way off the trailer. Uh, oh, 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 it's definitely got some suspension on it. Quick, I need to hide this before the wifey sees. Where is the best part? Hmm. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you next time over here in Minnesota. Thank you all for watching. Like, comment, and share and subscribe. If you want to play with all these mods and more, check out Apex Gaming PCs. They make a PC for the beginners and the pros.